Okay, guys. So, <coughs> cheat me, Christmas. Uh, so it's allergy season, but it's cold outside. And yeah, screw life some days. Um, anyway, so I'm dealing with all of that. So I am not easily vaping right now just because I've got allergy related uh, infection deal going on. Talk to the doctor. It's infection due to the allergies, so it's not a infection. I don't know how that works. Anyways, so I got these in yesterday um, from Mount Baker Vapor. I would do a first taste test, but I can't taste anything. Kind of hard to do my job when I can't do my job. So, regardless. Um, but that does not stop me from vaping and doing tests on things like native wick and seeing how it is if it catches fire because it got too dry, stuff like that. Um, so that's really cool. And then on my myriad of completely messed up, oh, it's right in front of me. I also have this. Um, and I will have my review coming up shortly. Now, the one thing I have to say, I'm sorry if I offend you guys, but screw the notch coil. Flavor on it is awesome, but I... Honestly, screw the notch coil. Uh, as far as it getting hot, it's just too it's too much to keep up with. But that's a whole other situation for when we do the review. Um, I am using the notch coil. It you know it does work, but I kind of I kind of prefer my dual twisted uh, d double twisted uh, coils over that. Notch coil does ramp up really fast, so when you forget that you have it all the way up, it just kind of burns in a heartbeat. But it hasn't popped on me, so that's a good thing. Aver production is really nice, but I don't know. I'm just I don't like it. It's 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 hard to stay wicked, and I can make smaller coils that give me more heat and give me a denser vape and don't take up so much of my juice because yeah it takes up a lot of space for juice so anyways so there's explain to me one of these days guys what's the deal with people and having the one on in the loud car I don't I don't get the idea maybe it's just me um, so Mount Baker Vapor sent me their free bottle which is French vanilla I will love to once I can taste it taste that they sent me Berry Crunch Cereal, which is Admiral Crunch Cereal, or Admiral Berry Crunch um, Cereal, uh, but it was just, the name was changed. And then I also have Gimmicks. Oh, Gimmicks, I'm looking forward to trying you. So, that's what I got in. Um, right now, I'm honestly, I, I don't even know what I'm vaping on, because <laughs> I can't taste it. Um, I could be, yeah vaping on just about anything as far as my body's concerned. Um, these are 15 mil bottles, so I'm gonna look forward to basically trying them and then not having any by the time I do the review, because that's just how life works. Um, so, that being said, guys, thank you very much for taking a chance to watch this video. Um, this Theorem tank, I will be doing a review on. The notch coil probably won't exist by that time. Actually, I think I have the first one. I already went through one. Yeah, I have the first one sitting right here. Um, just did some kind of like, hey, how does it do once it gets gunked up over, you know, the day? Uh, you know, if I try to heat it to... It is very springy. It's a very springy. I'll have to get out the big camera for that, but it's very springy. You can, you can make it a little wider. You can make it a little smaller. Very springy coil. So... Um, let's not lose this. <coughs> and then I have their original wick, which is going to go back inside of that for me to display it. I forgot that I had done that. So yeah, I am going to go blow the heck out of my nose, guys, and enjoy having allergies. And I will be back very, very soon, um, with my reviews. So thank you guys very much. Get some squirrels.